Many thanks, Patrick Amimo. And now let us go to Serena Hotel, where Cabinet Secretary in charge of public service and gender, Professor Margaret Corbier, is presiding over an event dubbed the Space of Women in Natural Resource Sharing and Budget Making Process. The event is currently underway. Let's just listen in. Assemblies have a big role to play in ensuring uh, the de that development plans and budgets address the needs and priorities of women, girls, and other marginalized groups. In many instances, resource allocation to social sectors is compromised in favor of other sectors that are perceived to rank higher in economic growth. Though women are a minority in parliament and county assemblies, they need to work together to build a very strong voice for gender responsive planning and budgeting and uh, allocation of adequate resources to social sectors to improve the social and economic well-being and status of women and girls in marginalized and, and other marginalized groups. Now, specifically, Kewoka members, we think that uh, you have the opportunity to influence the plans and budgets at committee level, as we heard from um, NGEC Commissioner, especially in social sectors, to guard and advance the gender equality agenda. Women MPs have first-hand experience on the practical needs and priorities of women and girls. You live in the communities. You see these challenges every day. You know what needs to be done to address these challenges. You therefore need to use your wealth of experience on these lived realities of women and girls in your own communities and use your big representative voice, as someone already mentioned before me, that you already are carrying uh, the voice of 50 plus percent of the population in Kenya. So you have the opportunity, you have the, uh, uh, the added advantage of knowing these lived realities of women in your communities where you're coming from, and you have the leadership platform to make a difference. So to do this effectively, as Keopa members, you will need to work very closely with the women's movement as we heard also from previous speakers on how partnerships brought a change uh, in terms of uh, providing the evidence, the data, the analysis that then made the, the change that Honorable uh, spoke about just earlier uh, before I took the floor. You also need to be very good friends with data, research and policy analysis because data and evidence will carry the day in any argument. For example, the recently published data on the Women Empowerment Index and the Comprehensive Poverty, uh, Comprehensive Poverty Report by KNBF in partnership with the Minister of Public Services and Gender, KIPRA, UN Women and UNICEF. We will go a long way to influence policies, plans and budgets to ensure that no one is left behind in the development process in Kenya. These reports are accessible on the websites of these partners that I just mentioned. Another role of... Well, live pictures of the ongoing event at Serena Hotel dubbed the Space of Women in National Resource Sharing and Budget Making Processes. Um, the Cabinet Secretary, Margaret Corbier, is presiding over this particular event. We'll definitely keep you updated.